The legal battle between the European Commission and Apple is still raging on. We need a bit of a backstory here. From the mid-90s and roughly for 20 years, the Republic of Ireland granted tax incentive to Apple. Apple at the time had two subsidiaries in Ireland. It was the so-called double sandwich, whereby Apple was able to stream its profits through the Irish Republic and saves a significant amount of taxes. But it was too big good to be true. In 2016, the European Commission declared the tax incentive granted by the island to Apple as against EU law because in breach of state aid rules. Of course, Apple appealed this decision and in July 2020, the General Court of the European Union ruled against the European Commission and in favor of Apple. Basically, the General Court of the European Union said that the European Commission had failed to prove that the incentive granted by the Republic of Ireland to Apple were in breach of state aid rules. But this legal battle hasn't ended yet. Predictably, the European Commission has appealed the decision of the General Court of the European Union with the European Court of Justice. We shall see what it happens, but this legal ordeal testifies to the fact that we really need new international tax rules in place. And the work done by the OECD is mostly welcome. The OECD is trying to introduce new rules to change the place of taxation for digital services and also new anti-avoidance rules for multinational groups. What do you think of this situation between the European Commission and Apple? I'm really interested in hearing your opinions. Please feel free to write them below this post. Thank you for watching this video again. Ciao!